welcome. This is Melissa Armour with the Stock Swoosh. I'm reviewing EXP8. This was the Stock Swoosh Show live trading room play of the day today. It worked. It was great. Um, I missed the low of the day. I said that doesn't always happen. Anyways, I was distracted because I was supposed to be scheduled to be on Fox News. Um, so then I found out I'm, I'm multitasking all the time. So I was trading, watching, writing talking points. I mean, it's just one thing after another and I missed the perfect exit, but actually everybody except for two people <laughs> had a lower the day exit in this down into 145.40, which was beautiful. I ended up getting out of this later, but let's go over the trade. We had a, we had a, we had a perfect, perfect egg, uh, entry in this we could not have gotten a better entry than this when we tried i like this i did it we, it was great it rated well so stock closed here the night before gap down boom we shorted it some people got out here and to be honest with you now that i'm looking at it here this was almost a low of the day right there at 9 32 that's crazy sold off like hotcakes though anyway some people did get out waited 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 some people got out here which was a really nice exit too that was a low of the day then it lifted up. I was still in it, waited, waited. I ended up having a good exit here once it started flatlining because I had to get ready to be on TV. But anyways, I still had a fabulous trade in this with really good profit. It's hard to get the low of the day exit. You don't always get that in a short. Sometimes I do, but it is hard. If I had paid more attention today, I would have, but some people did. I'm always striving for the best pick in the right direction, the best gap, and the best entry. And really, then you can make a decision on your own if you want to hold it or not. Usually, I don't hold it. This wasn't on purpose today. Again, I got distracted. But sometimes I do have a low of the day exit and a short, or a high of the day exit and a long. Uh, it's challenging to do that. I don't think people should make that their mission. What you should make your mission every day is to try to make money. You do want to try to find quality trades. I try to find quality trades, quality gaps. And again, get the best entry I can. Because remember, we have to be nimble. We have to be nimble what we're doing. Now, this lifted. This lifted because the market lifted today, but I don't think it's a big deal. I still think this could be lower. Let's look at this. It closed the night before at 160, 169. Boom. Open in the morning. This had earnings. It opened at 149.56. It was a nice trade. So again, if you're interested in learning more, how I find the best picks, how I rated this, how I did it, Email me at melissathestockswish.com. The next Golden Gap course is August 28th and 29th, Saturday and Sunday, 9 a.m. to 5 p.m. Eastern Time. Email me if you want more information. Cost of the class is $6,999. Don't delay. It's going to be a great close into the end of the year. It's been a good start to the year so far. I've been on fire with day trades. Uh, this was a nice pick, too, and I'm really glad we did it. Have a good day.